Hey guys, Original here. I'm going to uh, make a tutorial real quick since I just thought of it and I'm bored. And yeah, <laughs> it's a tutorial on um, the edge blur. Like in my videos, you guys like question me uh, and comment and stuff about how I get the uh, blur or what that effect is called. It's not really an effect. You kind of just make it from scratch. Uh, you're gonna need After Effects for this one. It just looks a lot better in After Effects, but you can do it in Vegas. But you just gotta like search for that because I don't think I want to make a tutorial on that on Vegas just yet. Uh, if you hear background noise, that's my uh, heater because yeah, I'm like really cold, so <laughs> I put my heater on. Um, so let's get started. Open up After Effects. Uh, import a clip or your clip that you want to add the. Uh, um, the what's it called? The blur on. I'm just gonna open up one of uh, Colin's <coughs> clips. I need to edit still. <laughs> right here, you'll see a uh, create new composition button. Drag the clip into create new composition. Drag the top right corner up a little bit so it gets rid of the black bars, and that looks pretty okay right there. Um what you're gonna do is go to right here layer and it'll drop down and it'll say new go down to adjustment layer or you can sh click control alt y um, and right here it'll make a new track called adjustment layer one what you do is click on that make sure that's selected go to the effects and presets well first of all go up here under effect and layer right here it says rectangle tool or you can hit Q on your keyboard you click on that go over to your clip and just click somewhere around there hold and drag it to uh, about there just like that so you have like a neat, neat, ah, neat little uh, square then go over to your effects and presets and type in G A U and it should come up Gaussian Blur. Drag Gaussian Blur into the little uh, square. Go over here on the uh, effects controls and where it says blurriness, make that like 13 or 14. Yeah, see how it's like really blurry in the middle now. You you don't want that, right? So click on the adjustment layer again go to where the, where the it says mask one and it says add drop the down bar and it says subtract click on subtract so everything outside of the uh, box gets blurry but you see how it's like a really harsh cutoff line and you can really see where the square is what you do for that is you go to mask right beside the yellow square there's a right arrow. Click the right arrow and it'll drop down about five things or four things. Where it says mask feather, there'll be a 0, 0.0 and then a comma and then a 0, 0.0. Click the first 0, 0.0, hold it, and move it to the right till about 300, I say. Like 304 or somewhere around there. And then right there. And you see how it has like a lot of blur around it? So maybe you don't want that much. All you do is, oops, that's not good. <laughs> uh, you click on it, click on one end, or hold control, and click on one of these squares, and drag it up, just like that, and click on each little square, and drag it over if you want, just like that, and that should get rid of the uh, most of the blurriness so that's how you do the blurry and um yeah hope you guys like like this tutorial uh message me if you want any other tutorials like leave a comment on any other tutorials i might do a color correction one or cinema 4d or something it's uh all depends on you guys just uh message me or leave a comment and if i get like a lot of likes on that one comment then i might do it uh, so, yeah, hit me up, and thanks, subscribe, comment, rate, whatever you want to do. Peace.